All right, now in this video, I'm gonna show you something very, very interesting. Let me unlock the phone here. Let's go to the Google application. This is Google. Let me tap on this. Now this is the page you're gonna see. And on the top, we have got Google Lens. Now, if I tap on Google Lens, you will see this page where you can pick up the images from the gallery to ask Google anything about that particular image. And now what I'll do is I will tap on open camera. Now we all know this page, it's quite familiar. Uh, we could point the camera at an object and ask uh, Google about that particular object or whatever you're seeing, whatever the lens is seeing, you can get some information from internet through Google Lens. Now this has got a brand new layout and some brand new features. Yes, Google has pushed an update which will add these amazing features. You can see at the bottom, we've got some additional options here. Now this search button was already there, gallery button was there, and translate button was there if I'm not wrong. And now you can see we've got live as well as create button. Now when I tap on live, let's see what happens. You can see I can talk to Google. This is the live search mode. I will be able to talk to Google. This is not Gemini. Gemini works similar to this. And now on Google, we can do something similar to Gemini. We'll be able to search for a particular object and talk to Google and Google will respond to it. Now let's demonstrate this. I will keep this particular object here, the uh, buds here. Let me go to live mode here. Hey Google, what are you seeing right now? What I'm seeing here is a white Samsung Galaxy Buds 3 charging case compatible with Samsung Galaxy Buds 3 Pro SMR 630 earbuds. This charging case supports both wired charging via its Type-C port and wireless charging. It houses a built-in 600 mAh battery capable of fully charging the earbuds three times. The charging case also features an LED indicator okay, can you stop? that displays the battery charging percentage. Would you like to know more about its features? Now, I can't interrupt the speech like we do with uh, Gemini Live. Here, once we ask the question, it is going to continuously talk about it. Uh, it will share some information about it. And then we also get some additional options at the bottom. Let's do this again. You can see we have got mute button, video button, and transcript button. If you want to turn off the video, you can turn it off. Uh, if you want to mute it, you can mute it as well. Now let me just unmute it and uh, video and you can go to the transcript also. You'll be able to see whatever you have just searched for. When you search for something, when you fetch some information from the internet through Google Lens, you will be able to see that transcript of whatever Google has provided on your video mode. Now that is very, very interesting. And it will also suggest a couple of websites from which we can get more information. So it's basically the Gemini's live mode now integrated into Google Lens, but it's not as advanced as Gemini where we can interrupt the speech and we can continue continuously talk to Gemini in live mode, in the live video mode, it's a little different over here. Now what's more interesting here is we have got another additional button here called create. Now let me go ahead and tap on this. Now this is nano banana if I'm not wrong because we've got this uh, banana icon here. So uh, this is more of an image generation model that we have. Uh, we have got some suggestions here. Uh, turn me into a teddy bear, create a Diwali pic of me, show new options. We can tap on show new options to get more suggestions. Turn me into a vinyl toy. Imagine me in the 80s, show new options. Using this feature, we can take a selfie or take somebody else's image and uh, use Nano Banana model to uh, turn the image into whatever you want. You can just describe it and uh, get it done. So that's how the uh, create feature works here. Now let me just uh, switch over to this. Now let me just take a picture of this. I'll just say, turn this into a cartoon. Let's send this, let's see what happens. It's actually in the AI mode here. And this is the same AI mode we see on Google search. Now let's see what is gonna happen with this image. There it is. This is the original image, you can see. And this one here is the one which we just created using this model on uh, Google's uh, Google Lens. Here is your generated image it says, and this is the cartoon image which I requested, which looks pretty cool. You can see, it's nice. So this is how you can use uh, this particular feature create on the Google application on Google Lens. And we of course have translate option and search button. Now this is something new and uh, you will be able to create a shortcut for Google Lens on the home screen or you can directly access from this particular widget, Google widget. You can directly get into the uh, Google Lens mode here, which is really nice. So this is something new. This is a brand new update. Now let me just show you the version number of Google application that I have. This is 16.42.64. 
uh, .ve, uh, .arm64. So that is the version number. If you have this version, you will be seeing those new options in Google Lens. Let me know whether you've got the update or not. Have you got this feature on Google Lens? Drop a comment. And if you're interested in this beautiful looking car wallpaper, these have been added on the Volvo's application. It's a premium car collection we have got. Let me just open the application for you guys. Now here, if you go to collections, uh, we have got uh, right here, cars. This is a new section we have just added. It's a premium collection. If you want to get rid of ads and if you want to unlock these premium collections, you have to go for premium or you will also get some free wallpapers right here under free section. So do go ahead and check out the wallpaper application Volvers. The link for the application is in the description. And when you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.